Published 0249 EDT, 21 September 2017 Updated 0522 EDT, 21 September 2017 A newly discovered species of hermit crab lives in the cavity of a walking coral as part of a symbiotic relationship. The clawed creature replaces its seashell with coral, helping it to avoid being buried in the seafloor sediment. In return, the coral provides the crab with a living home that grows with the creature, so it never has to be replaced. Scroll down for video A newly discovered species of hermit crab pictured lives in the cavity of a walking coral as part of a symbiotic relationship. The clawed creature replaces its usual marine worm partner with coral, helping it to avoid being buried in the seafloor sediment the new crab, named Diogenes heterosamicola to reflect its relationship with the heterosamia coral, is red and white, and has unusually slender legs and claws. Normally, hermit crabs have a curved tail segment which they coil into seashells to anchor themselves to their home. Most hermit crabs have an asymmetrical tail segment to fit the usually right-handed coil of seashells' homes. But D. heterosamia's symmetrical tail may better adapt it to walking corals, whose cavities may coil either way. The authors suggest the crab became a secondary partner for the coral after the sapunculancral relationship had already evolved. The new species is the only known hermit crab to partner with a living coral. The study, from researchers at Kyoto University, Japan, shows for the first time that species can swap their symbiotic partners. In marine ecosystems, certain walking corals act in partnership with marine worms known as sapunculans. The worm shelters in the coral's cavity, where it is protected from predators, in return providing transport and preventing the coral being buried in sand. The organisms have evolved a specialized codependence, and in such relationships, it is usually impossible to replace either partner with a different species. Hermit crabs are best known for scavenging seashells left by marine creatures such as snails to protect their soft abdomens. However, when the researchers studied walking corals in the Amami Islands of southern Japan, they identified a new species of hermit crab that adopts the walking coral as its home instead of a seashell. The researchers found that hermit crab appears to replace the worm in the usual sapunculancral partnership. Just like the worm, the crab transports the walking coral and can prevent the coral being buried by using its legs to brush away sediment. The new crab has been named Diogenes heterosamicola to reflect its relationship with the heterosamia coral. Living coral offers that hermit crab an advantage over seashells it grows alongside the crab, so it never outgrows it. The new crab, named Diogenes heterosamicola to reflect its relationship with the heterosamia coral, is red and white, and has unusually slender legs and claws. Normally, hermit crabs have a curved tail segment which they coil into seashells to anchor themselves to their home. Most hermit crabs have an asymmetrical tail segment to fit the usually right-handed coil of seashells' homes. Researchers studying walking corals in the Amami Islands of southern Japan have identified a new species of hermit crab that adopts the coral as its home instead of a seashell but D. heterosamia's symmetrical tail may better adapt it to walking corals, whose cavities may coil either way. The authors suggest the crab became a secondary partner for the coral after the sapunculancral relationship had already evolved. This is an interesting case in which an organism phylogenetically distant from sapuncula takes over the symbiotic role in association with a walking coral, the researchers wrote in their paper. The hermit crab species is unique in that its lodging is a living solitary coral that grows with the hermit crab in an accommodation transportation mutualism.